I'm just looking for some real friends All they ever do is let me down Every time I First of all, in today's video, I'm going to be doing a first impressions for the Soft Glam Palette. I'm so excited. Okay. And I stopped my makeup right here because I also got the Amorese Highlighter. I used some of this this morning and it is so pretty. But anyways. So I just did my makeup and now I'm going to apply the highlighter and try out the palette. So yeah, let's just get right into it. Okay, so like I said, I'm going to start out by trying out the highlighter. I mean, I've already tried it, but I'm going to use it. I couldn't really see it that well because it was like really bad lighting and it was really dark. Look how pretty it is. Okay, first of all, my skin is also <laughs> really glowy right now. That it, There's no highlighter on. It's just the foundation or something. I love the wave in it because it just shows how beautiful it is. So, swatching it. So, apparently it's like there's no fallout or anything. I really like applying highlighter with this ColourPop brush. It's like this small fluff brush, I think. But this morning I tried it with both the small fluff brush and a fan brush. I'm going to try it with this Morphe like highlight brush. I feel like this would actually be like the best thing to apply it. Oh. Yeah, so I like using it with this brush. So apparently like right now this highlighter is braided like the number one highlighter. A little up here. Oh my god. Definitely recommend this highlighter. It is so pretty because it's not one of those chunky glittery highlighters. It is so wet and smooth looking. It goes so well with my skin tone. And now I'm going to do my eyeshadow. Um, I have concealer on my eyes to prep my eyes. And oh my god, it's so pretty. So I have the Modern Renaissance and the Prism palette. So this will go to the collection with like the fuzzy packaging. But this one is supposed to be like the Modern Renaissance formula. Because there's like that whole subculture thing. Which I guess that's what the prison palette was too. So of course it comes with a free brush. I actually like their free brush. So I've never swatched this or like used this at all yet. I'm really excited. <laughs> but um, so first of all, this is what the packaging looked like. Anyways. So this is the palette, of course. Is that satisfying? It looks like there are nine matte, three like shimmers, two more chunkier glitter or like shimmer shades. So I'm just going to go ahead and get started with the look to start playing with, around with it. So I'm going to start by using Tempera and I just put this all over the lid. But this is a Y16 brush from Morphe and so for the soft glam palette there is some repeats from like the other palette which let me go get my other Anastasia palette here are the Anastasia palettes I own so of course Tempera is a repeat which is the shade I just put on but other than that repeats are Cypress Umber, Burnt Orange, Tempera there's Lure and Dusty Rose and it's these two purple shades I don't know if you can tell but they look like exactly the same I don't know if you can see that but they look exactly the same three that's like three repeat shades yeah it's not like the the same palette or anything I think that they're pretty different and I like the ones that they chose to repeat because I use this shade every time I use the modern renaissance palette to like set my concealer that's on my eyelids and I love burnt orange and cypress umber so going back to to the look then i'm gonna put then i'm gonna use i don't know where i'm going with this look honestly go with orange soda and i'm gonna use my y17 brush okay and to deepen the crease i'm where is it i'm actually going to use the brush in the palette and i'm gonna go in with burnt orange and deep in the crease i'm just gonna use like the flat edge of the brush and then i can blend it with the other side 
Now I'm going to go in with Rustic. I'm going to put that more on my outer V. I really want to use one of the shimmer shades because I love the shimmers in the Modern Renaissance palette. They're honestly the best shimmer I have ever used. They're just so pigmented. So amazing. Like, not even wetting it. They're so amazing. I kind of want to use Mulberry. I feel like Sienna and Mulberry would look really good together. Okay, this is Mulberry and then this is Sienna. But I'm going to use some of Mulberry for my um, outer V. Still using that same brush. Oh, shoot. And I tapped it off too. Um, that's another thing. Also, if you are a beginner at makeup, then these palettes might be kind of hard to work with because they are so pigmented. I mean, the reviews I've seen on the soft glam palette, I feel like people are just trying to find things wrong with it because they think it's going to be like the subculture palette. And honestly, I think it, this palette is really good so far. It is more like the modern renaissance palette. So I don't know. It just kind of annoys me. Uh, I think I'm going to go with the rose gold. First thing I'm going to do though is get some Tarte Shape Tape and um, the Morphe E10. And I'm going to carve out like the inner corner. The brush I normally use for like a lid shade is this ColourPop one, but it's blue right now, so I can't use that. So I guess I'll just continue using this brush, and I'm first going to use, it's called Rose Pink, and I'm first going to use it without any spray or anything. Oh my god, there's so much fallout with this shade. Okay, so I'm actually going to spray my brush and put a little more on, even though I think it looks really pretty right now. I just grabbed the spray that I saw first, which is just this rose water spray. Any spray works. Water works. And then I'm going to take I'm going to take Fairy, which is this shimmer shade. There's like two different gold shimmer shades in here. Fairy is a bit brighter and stuff and I'm just gonna tap that in the center and oh my god Ooh. okay so another new product is the benefit bad girl bang and this is not mine <laughs> this is my mom's actually I tried it out this morning so I don't really like how I explained this mascara in this clip so I just wanted to say that I really do like this mascara and that might be just because my lashes do naturally curl. Lately, I've seen a lot of YouTubers say they really like this for their lower lash line because they do not naturally have curly lashes, so they don't really use it on their top lash. The reason why I like it is mostly because the applicator is bendy. I just like even the feeling of putting it on. I also like how you apply it because the brush isn't too clumped up with a ton of mascara. So it's easier to apply without getting everywhere. But it's still like adding something to your lashes. Oh, and um, first let's do some lips. So originally I was thinking I was going to do a red lip. So yeah, these are two Anastasia lips. I found them at Marshall's. This one is a uh, deeper red and it is just a liquid lipstick in the shade in Seraphine. And then this is actually a lip gloss and is it is in the shade Neon Apple. And so yeah, I found them both at Marshalls one day. They're like $6. And I love the formula of their lip. Oh my god, I cannot apply a lip right, can I? Should I just keep it like this? Oh my god, the lip is... The lip is stealing the show. So then I'm going to put this one in the center. And then I'm just going to clean up a bit with some concealer because if you mess up a little, it's very noticeable when you have a red shade. So this, is, this brush is actually from Bare Minerals. It is the Max Coverage Concealer Brush. 
which I guess it was just my sister's or something. Okay, now it's so bright around the lip. I don't think I'm gonna go for any lashes today, so I think this is the final look. I'm just looking for some real friends. All they ever do is let me down. Every time I let somebody in, then I find out what they're all about. I'm just looking for some real friends. Wonder where they're all. So, thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed. Make sure you like and subscribe and. See you in my next one.